Here's an ethical question for you, and I'm so curious to hear what those of you watching this video think. So this is about GLP-1s and clinical trials and the participants. Now I came across this discussion somewhere else and I thought this was the perfect forum to discuss it. I wanna hear from you all on this. So think about the clinical trials that are going on for GLP-1s right now. And you've got a trial full of participants that are either obese or metabolically sick, some addicted, uh, struggling with chronic disease in some way or another. Now, consider in many of these trials, half of the people are on a placebo for a good number of months. Is that fair? Given what we know about GLP-1s and how they help people with chronic disease, like metabolic disease, like obesity, like diabetes, fatty liver, which can lead to NASH, is it really ethical at this point, given the efficacy of the class of medication, to continue to give half of these trial participants placebos. Now, admittedly, I'm not from inside this industry, so I don't know how all this stuff works, but it seems like we could be moving towards trials that just test one GLP-1 versus another rather than placebo, because these trial participants are giving up a good bit of their life with really no good treatment for their disease. Is this ethical? Me thinks not. Let me know what you think. Let me know. Sound off in the comments. Make sure you give my channel a follow as well.